Breaking news today where the NIH has stopped the AIM High trial for a lack of benefit of niacin for secondary prevention when added to statins. This is a long-awaited trial where the results uh, were released 18 months early, preliminary results due to a lack of benefit of niacin, a drug that raises HDL and lowers triglycerides to some degree, added to statins, apparently failed to show any clinical benefit in preventing cardiovascular events. This uh, study looked at patients, uh, about uh, 3,400 patients who had known vascular disease and very often the metabolic syndrome, that is low HDL, high triglycerides, and added high-dose niacin on top of statin and other lipid-lowering therapy so that LDL was well-controlled. And they found no difference in clinical events when followed out through 32 months. Um, they also, interestingly, and this led to the stopping of the trial early by the NIH, had an unexpected finding of a higher risk of ischemic stroke. The rates were 1.6% versus 0.7% in the statin-only group. Uh, some of them, they note, were long after stopping niacin, but that nonetheless was some harm seen when patients got both statin and niacin. And thus, a big defeat for what was seen to be a new therapy targeted at raising HDL. It is a modest increase in HDL that is achieved by niacin, but uh, one that shows it's difficult to es extrapolate smaller studies that suggested benefit with niacin to clinical outcomes. And as such, I think patients currently receiving niacin will really want to consult with uh, physicians and will want to relook at the indication for niacin in our patients uh, on the basis of these preliminary data. So for uh, CardioSource Video News, I'm Chris Canning.